I am Professor P. S. Banerjee, Chief Interventional Cardiologist, Monipal Hospital, Salt Lake. Today, I am going to discuss a very important topic, the cardiovascular disease in women. Now, this topic, why I have chosen because of the fact that this is not commonly discussed in any platform. And I think that females are also suffering from the cardiovascular disease and that is a great burden for the female. The discussion main point is that the disease starts practically when the patient has got any complication during the pregnancy, mostly related to the hypertension, or if the patient develops early menopause, or the patient takes the hormonal pills without doctor consultation for a long period of time. And the menarche is very important that if the menarche starts below the age of 12 years or after the age of 16 years, there is also increased chance of cardiovascular disease in the female during the middle age group. Now, you all know that pregnancy is a great risk when there is associated cardiovascular disease like hypertension or valvular disease or diabetes, etc. So, if the patient develops hypertension during the time of pregnancy, chances of cardiovascular disease, preeclampsia and eclampsia increases. And then in that case, when the patient completes the pregnancy in the later part of the life, there is more chance of cardiovascular disease in comparison to women who do not have any pregnancy related uh, complication with hypertension. So thereby the awareness among the female is very important that if their whole sexual life as well as the menstrual life period is uneventful, there is no disease like polycystic ovarian disease or other disease like diabetes, hypertension, dyslipidemia, in that situation, they can usually have an uneventful cardiovascular uh, history in the next part of the life. But if they develop any complication with hypertension during pregnancy, like preeclampsia, eclampsia, diabetes, polycystic ovarian disease, sleep apnea, all these are very important related to the cardiovascular disease. So thereby, what I would suggest that Awareness about this cardiovascular disease is female is very important, particularly in the low socioeconomic group, the age between 25 to 45 years age, which are very, very common for the development of cardiovascular disease. So lifestyle modification, control of obesity, the sleep apnea, hypertension control, diabetes control, treatment of the hypothyroidism and dyslipidemia are all important and maintain a healthy life throughout the period will help them to reduce this impact of the cardiovascular disease during the whole part of their menstrual and the postmenstrual period thank you very much